Hey guys, um, I guess today I just really wanted to talk about, um, magic versus, um, you know, magic. If you hear sirens in the background, sorry, I'm, uh, on one of my night walks again. They seem to be pretty close, though. Anywho. So... Yeah, I wanted to talk about magic versus magic and, you know, what that means. Um, like, why do people spell it differently? Personally, I mean, yes, I, I did at one point spell it differently. You know, I think I spelled it tradition, traditionally, you know, like with a K. Um... I think we all do, you know, when you first get into magic, you learn that so many people have adopted this, um, this way of spelling it with a K to differentiate from magic, M-A-C, wait, M-A-G-I-C, uh, which has become like illusion magic or like stage magic, like fake magic, um, and there's nothing wrong with that. You can spell it however the hell you want. I've seen spell, people spell it M-A-G-Y-K. M-A-G-I-K. Actually, I think that's the Russian spelling for magic. Um, just the word magic. I mean, you can spell it however the hell you want. I've seen people spell it M-A-G-I-Q-U-E. It's crazy. Um, but you can spell it however you want. Um, but lately... I say lately. It's kind of you know, rumbled through my head the past couple of years, but I've gotten into the habit of spelling it M-A-G-I-C, with no K. Um, you know, people talk a lot about reclaiming words, and I think that this is just one of those words that I want to, you know, reclaim. I have mixed feelings about the whole reclamation, like movement but that that's a whole nother topic i guess um but yeah magic m-a-g-i-c and you know i've pretty much when it comes to like labels i've let uh anyone pretty much put whatever label they want to on me in terms of my spirituality like i'll answer to someone saying jake are you a witch yes are you a shaman yes are you a druid yeah are you, you know, hoodoo? Yeah, totally. Are you a KO? Yeah, sure. Like, it's just whatever. Just whatever makes it easier for them to understand, kind of have a grasp of what it is that I believe. So that we don't have to sit there and talk for like hours and hours and explain our differences. Which sometimes you want to do that. <laughs> sometimes it's really cool, but there's some people you just, you know, you just don't want to. It's not worth your time. You want to talk about other things. You want to move on with your life. So, anyway, uh,. Yeah, I mean, where did that spelling differentiation come from, right? I mean, it's always been M-A-G-I-C, but people wanted to differentiate back, you know, after, like, Houdini and, like, what was his name? Like, Joseph Wren? Joseph Wren, I think? Joseph Wren was, like, his partner. Um, after people like that started, you know, making traveling acts of stage magic, like, illusionism, so popular. And I guess it's just kind of stuck, the differentiation of spellings. But, you know, <sighs> stage magic is not really a thing anymore, in my opinion. <laughs> I mean, I know certainly there are still people who like it, who, you know, do things like shows in like Las Vegas and stuff like that. People who do it as a hobby. But, I mean, is it really a huge part of our culture anymore, of our like popular consciousness? I don't think so. So, I'm taking back the word magic, and I'm taking back the term magician for myself. If that's, if I'm gonna need to have a term for myself, which I guess I don't need to. I've gone this long without it, but I guess I kinda want one now. I'm gonna go with magician, that's what I do. I practice magic, I'm a practitioner of magic. That's a magician. <laughs> no apologies, and no K. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Anyway, I guess it's just my little like, declaration of yeah i'm gonna do it i'm gonna be called a magician like 
Bye.